Hey guys, Commando933 here doing a review, uh, finally, <laughs> doing a review on the, uh, Star Wars Lego, uh, what's it called, the AC, ACR-170 fighter. Uh, just back there I have a little scene I set up. So, um, anyway, uh, I'll start with the figures. One, it comes with Captain Jag, uh, I guess I'll show you him get all these people out first yeah I should have gotten them out first but I didn't feel like it so anyway uh, here's Captain Jag he has a different helmet I gotta get rid of the background he has a different helmet design than all of the other guys oh my god I hate how this is so blurry sorry but he has a different helmet design and uh, yeah but I don't think anything else is different. But besides that, and here is a clone pilot for the back gun. Uh, we also have Kit Fisto. Uh, I get. I think that yeah, this is the first figure of Kit Fisto that we've ever seen. But um, he he's like all the other Jedi's. But except for he has a squishy head. I don't really favor Jedi's. I, if I ever do a stop motion, I don't want to do it with a Jedi because uh, they, you know they like never die. So yeah, because the, I just hate Jedi's. I don't know why, but they never die, so it never makes it fun. And then here you have the droid R4P44. He's uh the droid. He's the droid that goes in the AC ACR-170 fighter that like maintains it, sort of like R2D2. He's one of those droids that finds the problems and shows them how to fix it and everything. You know, one of those droids. One of those that all those clone pilots and everything has to have. But um, anyway, I'll just throw him in there. Anyway. Oh, oh. Do the review on this now. Uh, the shit, it's pretty cool. I, it's, uh, 396 pieces. Don't need the box, I can memorize all the stuff. These spin, these are the engines. It's pro surprisingly small in the back. I thought they'd be a little bit bigger. And, um, the, it, the top is detailed because you really wouldn't see the bottom. It's really, like, not detailed at all on the bottom, but they did what they did. You know, that's how they do it. The, um, all these compartments open, you know. Uh, there are two laser gun, laser, oh, sorry, one that fires laser and another, a missile launcher on each side. There is a gunner in the back, has two. And, yeah, there's one thing, I think this is pretty cool in it. Let me just lift this up. I wish I could hold the camera the same time I did this, but I can't really, so I have to figure out how to get this. Yeah, there we go. Right here in the back, if you turn this. And my shit, for some reason, um, this didn't come with all of the pieces, so I had to revert to uh, getting some of my own, like on the wing. But it, for some reason, it didn't have the last piece right there. I have no idea. So now the ship looks a little weird, but still looks pretty cool. Especially from the front, it looks pretty sick. Uh, I mean, th this ship is probably one of my favorite fighters because, I mean, it's just awesome. Sadly, it's. Sadly, Le Lego Star Wars doesn't make that many fighters for the clones like the V Wing anymore. And, uh, all those other classic ones from Episode 3. But, yeah. I mean, I love what they're doing here. I love how they got all... I, it's amazing how much detail they have into this. With just, you know, with just this little bit of pieces. But, yeah. There's not much really to say besides the decals on the side of, I believe, yeah, keyboard thing for the clone trooper here, I guess. Not completely sure, and then I have no idea what that is. The symbols here, and 
I don't know what that is for. I guess it's just part of the paint job. But, yeah. Uh, it's fun to do these reviews, and I hope to do more in the future. Uh, I actually have some new custom clones. I will... Uh, basically, they're two. They're normal commandos. But, they're pretty cool. I also have some new... Um, how many new sets? Uh, two or three. I think it's two. I don't know. I got like two two new sets, including this one. I have an AAT, so soon I'll be doing that in the future. And yeah, sorry for none of the reviews. I also have a Sergeant Forge review that I'm going to be doing on any of those any of those Halo figure reviews that I do too. So yeah, uh, I'll see you guys later, so please comment and subscribe, and I will see you on all my other videos. Alright? Over and out.